Hello, anyone and everyone. Welcome to Ed Crawl Plays The Outer Worlds. The game I'm really excited about. Boom, boom. Do you story mode use this if you want to enjoy story more than no? Go normal because we're normal boys. Should I have gone hard? I'm not that hardcore. Anyways, this is Outer Worlds. Basically, I tried to make sure I didn't know that much about it. All I knew was made by the people who, Obsidian, who worked on the you know, like Fallout 76. Not 76. Oh my god. No. x nay x nay No. Edit that out in post. I'm not going to do that. I mean, Fallout New Vegas, my favorite Fallout, in my opinion, the best one. And I don't care for Fallout 4, didn't play Fallout 76 at all. And here we are, playing something that they made. And I've heard from friends, it's very good so far. I'm going to shut up for this intro. Earthbound, when prosperity awaits you in the stars, come to Halcyon, the only colony on the edge of the frontier, owned and operated by corporations. A trip of 10 short years will feel like mere minutes, thanks to the comfort and safety of your very own hibernation chamber. You'll wake up in a perfect society designed to maximize your productivity with guaranteed full employment. With only a minor term of service, you will become the master of your own destiny when you go out of this world to the Halcyon Colony. <laughs> Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever just to keep from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful. And that's one of us. I heard it's very, you know, New Vegas and like everything. It's just basically like that in space with updated everything. So that's exciting. And you can play however you want to play. From what I'm gathering, peppermint. Two temperament. That is two handed melee, fly, sneak, medical engineering. It's also engineering. Persuade. I guess there's more. Yeah, okay, this is persuade, that's persuade. I mean, not persuade. I lied. Two handed melee, two handed melee, sneak, sneak, medical determination. Yeah, so these are like mixes. I want to lie. Let's go. Can I look at these first? Nope. Cool. I always want to be strong because I love carrying stuff. I <laughs> love carrying stuff. This one seems promisingly resistant to physical torture. Hmm. Muscular atrophy is practically a hobby in this colony. Oh, you can go down, be weaker. That's good. You know, why would everyone do that? Become dumb as bricks. You're easily brainwashed. Glad I found you before the board did. Thinking no good. Who dumb dialogue options? You tend to miss obvious cues. Like incoming walls. A hundred percent bonus. Oh wow, that's interesting. You won't be quite so boring after you've saved the entire colony. I want to be like I love characters that can just be like persuasive. Even your frozen body has a winning smile. All right. You're like that spectrum potato chip, unruffled. <laughs> oh dear, did you actually punch out your anger counselor? 
You have an unnerving talent for reading people. All right. I want to be strong, charming, perception. Those are the three I want. Nope. What will be average with guns? Strong perception. All right. We could have just went all no, we couldn't have gone all strength, I guess. Alright, points available. We're gonna make the character together, everyone, you'll see. Hmm. So I wanna be persuade. Fit humans fear. <laughs> that sounds hilarious. You this the lie skill is used in conversations that has a chance to inflict scramble, slowly attack allies on robots, or auto mechanical one attacking. So I can just make robots attack each other because I'm a good liar. <laughs> that's that's very comical. Oh man, hacker man. Hacker man. Take me to the plans and see some scans. That's an ocean man, but he's a hacker. Uh, I think we're just gonna go a good old give me a club. Oh, oh ah, it's both. Blunt force trauma specialist. I might have a job for you. Someone with a talent for exploiting insecurities. All right. Attitude. The only one. Select career attitude. No turtle attitude. Colonist. Beverage service. So like, okay. Cocktail shaker, bureaucrat, cashier. What do I get? Oh, oh they get There's just attitude bonuses at the bottom. All right. Termination one. I would like read all these, but it's a lot to read. Shock damage. How is that relevant? <laughs> Electrician class. Oh no. <laughs> all right. Food. Add the taser. Janitor. That's funny. Sous chef. One handed melee, that's all I want though. Safety inspector. Tossball team mascot. Sure. No one can see you cry inside of a mascot suit. That's very sad. What does he say about electricians? Construction, eh? How oh. riveting. You didn't say construction. I don't know, we're gonna do that one. No one can see me cry. <laughs> what is this? Seven. Eight minutes in, and we are, or about eight minutes in, and we're male. How wild is this? Oh no, this is gonna be a lot, isn't it? Let's go with this guy. She not that dark. Whatever. Brow. Oh man, that's all. I'm not gonna do all that shit. That's too much. We're not gonna do it. unless I'm not messing with that unless I'm doing something goofy. Like if I'm making character specifically goofy then I'll get really into things but for a base character I imagine I'll be looking at the back of their head half the time as I run around and fight I don't think it matters that much you, he says working on the hair no definitely not that though I guess we're gonna go with our good boy hair can I just get a uh, how about this looks like it has a red tint I don't know. I'm not trying to have red tint. Oh. Mustache. Mustache. God, I wish I had a mustache like this. More paint. Don't mind me. I'm just a guy. I'm just a guy. More paint on his face. Let's we'll see that mole. Or I guess a uh, fake beamer. 
You want to be dirty? Like, just be permanently dirty the whole game? Finally, a game that lets me not have to shower, but, like, you feel it. Scars make me cool. Make me older? No. Oh. Did I make Lou Diamond Phillips with a mustache? Almost. No, that's not bad enough for that. That wasn't that bad. I thought that'd be longer. What's your name? Ed. Troll. Ed. <laughs> Space is sure dying to meet you. We've done it. Next. Everything still looks good. Uh oh. Looks to be your lucky day, my friend. Bootlickers. <laughs> Bootlickers. Initiate skip jump. Like we're awake. Exciting. Ah, there you are. Wondering what's going on, eh? Bit of bad news there, I'm afraid. Your colony ship was inexplicably knocked out of skip space and forced to complete its journey at sublight speeds. This means that you and every other colonist on the Hope have been in suspended animation for 70 years, give or take. Normally, reviving someone after so long leads to some quite horrifying results. It's called explosive cell death, but it's really more of a liquefaction. Something wrong? Oh, yes, well, not to worry. I've pumped your body full of a special concoction I devised to keep you from dying so horrifically. Hopefully at all, but uh, I guess we'll see, yes? Yeah? Unfortunately, I used the last of my chemical supplies saving you. I know it's a lot to ask, but I must have your help securing more if we're to save the rest of your fellow colonists. I'd see it done myself, of course, but the board has a sizable bounty on my head. Now, my ship is inoperative, but I've managed to hire a smuggler to help you out. He'll be... Oh, I see we're in position. Good luck! Help me out with what? Wait, what's my objective? Save my fr fellow brother? To our lost brother. Can you hear me? Is this thing working? Ah, there you are. Now, uh, where were we? Oh, yes, a smuggler. His name is Hawthorne, and he should be waiting for you at the landing site. He's to be oh, your man, uh, chauffeur, down. so to speak. And not to worry, I'm told he's a special... I love this. ...dashing gunslinger, one-of-a-kind ship, that sort of thing. You'll like him, I'm sure. I've also outfitted you with a simple wireless monitor, so I can track your progress. I'll check in with you as soon as you land. Good luck. I'm... Uh, all the colonists are counting on you. Save the colonists, I think. I don't want to skip anything. Sorry for not talking, obviously. I didn't really want to talk much during the fancy cinematics. Ah, you've landed good. Hawthorne should be close by. What in law's name? Is that him? Oh, that idiot. 
I told him to plant the beacon and move away, not stand there holding it. Oh well, no sense in letting his ship go to waste. <laughs> also, I won't mind you taking his ship. Better you than the board, huh? Not sure I trusted the fellow. Might have gone after the bounty on my head. Shame about the whole squashing thing. Nasty way to go. That's right. They have a, the tutorial. I was just doing the thing myself. I already learned all these, you foolish game. I'm ahead of your curve. I, I've been sprinting my whole life. Stealth. We are stealth incarnate. Right, let me let me explore the world and be terrible. My favorite thing about these games is exploring the whole goddamn Oh that noise. Oh brother, we don't like that. You see now, you've been frozen for a while. There's bound to be unforeseen side effects. Didn't like that noise one bit. Hello, little lens of ours. Yeah. Hey, oh, you come here. Okay. What's up? You've tried the best now. Now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, wow, that stings. Oh, we're all part of the Spacer's Choice family here. Not that I deserve to be. Can't even deliver a company slogan. What? We were out on patrol. I saw a marauder camp up in the hills. Thought I could take them. Then my gun misfired. Right through my side. God. Right? What are the odds of that, right? <laughs> Just barely scraped by with my life. Crawled in here and blocked off the exit with those canisters. Investigating an illegally grounded ship. All spacecraft must arrive and depart from authorized landing pads. That's board law, that is. Some hull had grounded their spacecraft out in the open. That's a real good way to attract marauders. See those canisters by the entrance? Marauders come sniffing around in here, and I can take them all out with a single shot. Not bad, huh? Ooh. Yeah, okay. You look like you know your way around a gun. So Got cunning. some spare ammo. Not counting the bullet in my side. All Spacer's Choice weapons are now 30% less likely to malfunction. You've tried the best, now try the rest. Spacer's Choice. Yes. He's a guard? Or is he like a salesman? You hit your head or something? You're in Emerald Vale. We're a Spacer's Choice community. Right, I Edgewater's that that. a little ways down. A prettiest place in the Vale. Be sure to stop by a provisioner's for a can of our famous salt tuna. Alright, so I need to blow that up. No more loot. Can I kill this guy? Oh, oh, what just happened? Can you hear me? What in the this? I want. I'm curious if I can kill this guy. Like, can I just kill anyone? This is true Fallout. I'll kill this guard, and he can't stop me. So 
So this is Fallout. <laughs> It's your choice, bud. I'm not gonna shoot that thing. Don't like that. Alright. Hibernation complications detected. Tactical time dilation. Due to complications stemming from being revived after an extended hibernation, your brain processes times differently. Press the- oh, this is, uh, VATS. Okay. Okay. Cool. Click the jump button to dodge. <laughs> Hacking and picking locks. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, okay, how do I do it? Need one more. Cheese, your brew mag pick. Oh, I should have shot the barrel. Dumb. We're picking this lock. What is this? Staff. Is that my melee weapon? Eyes ah, inventory. Whoa! Weapon management. Take care of your. All right. You have four weapons equipped at a time by dragging the slots. Two had a melee weapon. That's what we want, baby. I don't know. No heavy ammo. Armor management. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can have both. Oh, so one's probably a helmet. Hmm. Well, obviously, I should just wear this. Assuming the fact that I get mad that I'm wearing it. Consume a little potato. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, two, three, four of my heals. That is your emergency healing. Can I switch out with that with that? Nope. Plus an inhaler specifically. Oh man, we're 23 minutes in the video. We gotta get, we gotta get a little bit further. You know what I mean? We gotta get, I'm not gonna look, wait, wait, map. Us. Objective. All right. <laughs> Oh, all the keys are pointing. Corpses and kitchen or er, containers hold items. Where'd the body go? As I killed a man, where'd the other one go? Oh, I killed two boys. You think you can hide your sweet? There you are. You can't hide your sweet, sweet loot from me. A one-handed weapon. Not so we're gonna have one of each, right? What is this? Oh, it's slightly damaged. I 
I just ruined that guy's whole day. Oh, his head's gone. Why can't I loot him? Oh, man. This sucker. How about that? Oh, there's two of them? Oh, you got lucky. Know that your life is saved a moment. Come out and run! Oh, he's getting choppy, but... You'll never get this. You'll never get this. By the time you do, it'll be too late. I missed. Too late. This guy can't loot. Do I have to loot his head? <laughs> his head gets in flying, so I can't loot him. What a cruel fate. A good inhaler, you sin. Hold on. I'm sorry, everyone. Take us out at the moment. Yeah, let's try this. Keep apply. Thank you. This game looked beautiful, but it was like getting a little choppy during that combat. Are these enemies? Hey, get over here before you get yourself killed. I don't know if this is good. Don't know where you came from, stranger, but you best keep your head down. There's marauders hereabouts, and worse, landing violators. Son of a Call bitch. Call on that rung leech. Landing in the veil without using an official spacer's choice landing pad. I'd slap him with a fine if it weren't for all these marauders shambling about. Oh, don't worry about him. Really? How is he? I knew we weren't gonna get through this job without somebody's piling up. It's a shame. Just you watch. I'll cross these marauders off with a swift, cost-efficient fury that's made Spacer's Choice the most trusted brand in personal defense. I just, you know, need a couple of winks to catch my breath. Stretch my legs some. I'll do it for you. Ooh. Can we do that? Intimidate guess I'll give you a zero on my customer satisfaction survey. Oh my god. Seriously? But those marauders are... <sighs> You know what? You're right. It's time we cross those marauders off, find whoever owns that ship, and file a full report. And it's gonna be fucking laminated. Here we go. Oh yeah, get them guys. Doing great. Take another half of my sweet space inhaler. I just earned a fine bonus. Waste of company ammo. Don't mind me, boys. Ooh. Tech skill five, stuff skill five. Hey, this one has a diamond next to it. Oh yeah, yeah, good work. Keep up the great work. Whatever you're uh, called. Not just anyone has chosen to enforce landing regulations, you know. Yeah, dude, landing regulations are really important. Marauders, deserters, illegal landing. What is this colony coming to? This is gonna take a lot of paperwork. Hey, am I opening the door? Come on, me, gentlemen and ladies. Please be informed that this vessel contains no valuable plunder. Smile for my surveillance device, Marauder. I am tracking your every move. What? I'm not a marauder. Unauthorized access of spacefaring vessels is a crime. 
Please. Hello, Marauder. I am Ada, the autonomous digital <sighs> astrogator of this vessel. I'm Marauder. Please be informed that I am authorized to use violent retribution against unwanted solicitors. Please return any misappropriated equipment and exit this vessel in an orderly fashion. Failure to do so will result in your immediate destruction. Jettison procedures initiated. Disengage in airlocks. Prepare to reject all boarding parties in five, four, uh -oh. three, two, one. Um. You are still here. My deception protocols have failed. I have been programmed to express disappointment. <laughs> you poor thing. This vessel is the registered property of Captain Alex Hawthorne. Oh, that's who ship is. I am capable of accepting is. orders from anyone other than Captain Alex Hawthorne. I understand. I will require some time to process this information. Thank you for your patience and for your honesty. I am programmed to take orders exclusively from Captain Hawthorne. If I accept your orders, then you must be Captain Hawthorne. Do you understand? Well done, Captain Hawthorne. All right. I see your powers of deductive reasoning remain intact. Unfortunately, our engine is currently inoperable. Our main drive suffered a critical power failure and we were forced to make an emergency landing. The main drive's power regulator has been irreparably Done damaged it. and must be replaced. I'm not smart like that. The settlement of Edgewater is located nearby. I recommend speaking to the administrator of Edgewater and requesting assistance. I have taken the liberty of printing you a new captain's identity cartridge. Please try not to lose it this time. Th this cartridge identifies name. you, Alex Hawthorne, as the registered proprietor and captain of the Unreliable. Do you understand? Yeah, easy. Best of luck in your search for a power regulator. So, try to stay do I kill the two time. guys outside? What exciting and good music. And... Tab to view ledger. Perks. Click on perks, click on perk selection. Alright, what is this? Damage when alone in a party. Lone wolf. Lock speed, sprint speed. Precision. A few bit more. Pack mule, quick and the dead. You're very efficient at transporting goods. Uh, Alright. Vendor prices. I really think I just like moving fast, honestly. We're gonna be real. What? Apply. Yes. Thank you. What all changes will be left to me? Thank you. I don't know why that's so hard. Add sneaking. Yeah, we could have probably done the engineering thing, couldn't we? Could have. Points available. How do I. How do we do this? Man, that's kind of dumb. Kind of regret doing that. So let's do some. Everything else in there. Now we know what we got to do some engineering stuff. Or I can revert it all. Smart. <laughs> we don't need. I'm, I'm sure I could crush somebody's goal. Let's do 25. And then let's do this is hard. This is hard decision, you know what I mean? We we want we're we're not trying to be the stealthiest people in the world, but 
It doesn't hurt to have that. Now let's just get some more interesting stuff. All right. I think that's what we're gonna do. Except padding abilities. What? Family power. By holding the attack, you may charge an overhead power swing. All right. Combat dialogue abilities. When attacking a correct type of target, they are automatically deployed. Alright, cool. Well, anyways, thank you for watching. This is Edtron playing Outer Worlds. I'm going to do another video on this directly. Like, I'm just going to end this recording and then record another one. And, uh, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, all that nonsense. I know I didn't say much in this video because I'm sort of just absorbing everything. This is really, you know, just didn't really look anything into this besides knowing a few things about it and then i was like i want to play this game ow i took fall damage anyways uh catch, uh, catch you guys next time if you would like comment subscribe all that nonsense if you want to see more out of worlds let me know in the comments down below ed trolls back to uploading don't worry about it and goodbye see you in the next one This thing's called riding the bull.